So, why should you go to see the Opera Santa Barbara production of Manon? Well, many reasons. One thing, Manon really benefits from staging. It's a spectacle. You get the whole of 18th century Paris. You get a sense of the interrelationship between various sort of private worlds and the public world. You get a strong sense of how one influences the other. But I suppose primarily you'll go because of the two main roles. Uh, Manon is uh, one of the great sort of uh, one of the great roles of the French repertoire. It has been referred to as the French Isolde because it is an extremely long role. It makes considerable demands on the voice. Um, it requires both a voice that could can sing coloratura, but also can engage in the more sort of dramatic passages that are crucial for so many of the major roles that women sing in late 19th century opera. Uh, and opera Santa Barbara um, is uh, particularly sort of uh, fortunate to have acquired the services of Sarah Coburn, uh, who uh, will be singing the role. I think she has great charm on the stage. She has great pa uh, capacity to uh, project her personality out into the audience. Uh, but also she has a wonderful um, capacity with uh, sort of the, the more technically difficult coloratura aspects of the role. I, I've seen her in two performances, uh, one both down in Los Angeles, one in uh, Handel's Tamilano, where she showed a, 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 a wonderful capacity to really sort of cover all the very technical, problematic aspects of the Da Capo arias. Uh, but also she sang uh, Gilda in Rigoletto. Uh, um, in, to my memory, I've seen Rigoletto, oh, I don't know how many times now, but I think that hers was the most engaging Gilda that I've ever seen. And so I really do feel that she will probably be the centre of this production and will be well worth uh, people attending to see it. Um, don't miss this um, unique opportunity.